guys, we got this 09 Matrix, and we're gonna take out the water pump. We're gonna trace out the belt pattern first, and then we're gonna loosen this bottom 12 millimeter. We've been having a grinding sound, but I think that's just the the water pump going out. There's a buildup of some kind around the bolt, so it's leaking something. All right, guys, so. I had to pop the alternator out just to make it easier on me. Don't pull it like a savage because down there's a little, a little harness that runs down to your uh, AC compressor, I think. So I just swiveled it up, held it right here on the intake, and then uh, in a 12 millimeter uh, long socket, and there's five bolts. Match them up with the new part. Guys, here's the water pump. You can tell it was leaking already. And it literally just slides out. Um, two of the bolts are longer than the other three, so make sure you keep them all separate. These two are long bolts right here. You have to remove the tire, go underneath. You can do everything from up top. Just clean it up, put the new one in. Don't forget to remove your gasket. It sits in a little groove right in here in the housing. Right in the new one. It's right in the same spot right there. Just follow the little outline. Guys, it's in there. The two, these two top bolts are the long ones and then the small ones go around. I'm not adding any RTV or anything because if I have to go back in there again, I don't want to have to deal with cleaning that tight space. So now I'm going to tighten them up, put the alternator back, and we're done. Everything can be done up from the top. Alright guys, and those are all, uh, all the ones on the water pump are 12mm. Use a long socket. You should be able to get all the way around. Find the right angle. It pumps in, ran the belt, I'm running the lower alternator bolt, and install the bracket, adjust the alternator, and we're done. Ultimate alternator is adjusted, popped everything in there, belt's nice and tight, we're ready to go. Started and run it, but I don't hear no more grinding, we're ready to go, get your weight up. So now what I'm doing is I'm bleeding the system, jack the car up from the front, and I'm slowly filling, I'm slowly filling the radiator until all the bubbles are done coming out. Before I started doing this, it was only blowing cold air, so now we got hot air. This seems to be. Almost all the bubbles there, so we're ready to go. Repair was a success.